Top 5 Best presents WTF Weddings You Won't Believe Getting married is a thing that most people aspire to do at some point in their lives. There are classic traditions when it comes to weddings, such as the bride wearing white and the groom wearing black. But there are some other weddings that are just plain crazy. Number 14. The Longest Dress this Chinese bride held the world record for the longest bridal train. It measured in at 656 feet long, with guests having to hold part of it as she stood at the altar. This record was later broken in 2006 in Cyprus with a train that measured 4,468 feet long. Number 13. Cream Puff Dress This Ukrainian pastry chef made a wedding dress for his bride. Valentin Stefano was a pastry chef in 2008 when he got married to Victoria. He's well known for his often inventive and delicious creations. It's not clear how she managed to sit at any time during the wedding, which she admits was embarrassing at first, since a lot of people turned up just to see her dress. The dress was made of sugar, eggs, caramel, and flour. Number 12. Wedding ring piercings. I do means forever, and if you're someone who really, really means it, getting a wedding ring piercing doesn't seem so strange. The courting has changed throughout the centuries. Sometimes people want to go that extra mile. Marriage is a commitment, and nothing shows you are more committed to something like a wedding ring piercing. Number 11. Rice Wedding. Some couples like putting a little fun in their ceremonies by doing some weird wedding photos. You may have heard of people throwing rice at weddings. Well, these two thought you should have a whole dinner mixing protein with their carbs. Number 10. Robot Priests in 2010, this couple's wedding in Japan was officiated by a robot. This was supposedly the first time a wedding has been led by a robot. The one seen here is an eye fairy and is four feet tall. A man behind the scenes controls the robot, who apparently drew lots of joy and laughter from the crowd. The bride works for Kokoro, the manufacturer of the robot, while the groom is a robotics professor. Number 9. Bridal Diapers there's been some debate online whether brides really wear diapers underneath their wedding dresses. The reason for doing so is that wedding ceremonies can run long and bridal dresses are often complicated. The easy way to deal with it? Wear a diaper. It's a practical, albeit gross, way to go to the bathroom without having to run off in the middle of the ceremony at reception. Number 8. Married to the Eiffel Tower a woman now known as Erica Eiffel has a fetish for inanimate objects. She's apparently been in a relationship with the Eiffel Tower for 10 years, officially marrying the tower in 2007. She identifies with being OS, which is when someone is attracted to inanimate objects. A documentary was filmed about Erica and this OS aspect of her life. Number 7. Shark Cage Wedding Shark Week is quite the popular phenomenon, and with all the very extreme weddings out there, it's not so surprising that getting married in a shark cage is a thing. At the Long Island Aquarium, brides and grooms can be submerged in a tank of sharks while they get married. Number 6. Chamber Pot in France, couples are gifted with a chamber pot to eat out of. It's usually leftovers from the reception after a long night of festivities. It's not as common nowadays, but there are still those that partake in eating out of the pot. But the tradition has evolved, with some people now eating out of toilet bowls. By the way, the chamber pot is usually new. Number 5. Themed Weddings so theme weddings are quite popular now. There's loads of ideas out there, from Hogwarts wedding invitations to the bridal party dressed as characters from Lord of the Rings. This couple went a little further and had the groom dress up as Mon Calamari from Star Wars, complete with members of the Empire. In fact, their wedding officiant was dressed as Slave Leia from Return of the Jedi. Number 4. Fast Food Wedding whether the couple couldn't afford it or they simply wanted to, weddings have been known to serve fast food and even take place inside fast food restaurants. And with chain fast food places now offering catering, it's a little easier to do so. This past year, a couple got married at a McDonald's after two years of dating. Before them, in 2013, a couple had their reception at a McDonald's in England that only cost 150 pounds. Number 3. Blackening the Bride it's Scottish tradition to blacken the bride a few days or weeks before the wedding. This custom is mostly practiced in rural parts of Scotland. Either the bride or groom, or both, get covered in food or other substances. The rules are that it's just gotta be as messy as possible. Number 2. Bungee Jumping 
When Ross B and Hannah P got married, it was at the Highland Fling bungee platform in Scotland. The two did a tandem bungee jump as a way to symbolize their union, while most people just kiss. It was the first ever bungee jump wedding in Scotland. The workers at the bungee jump had to attend, of course, and they did wear a wedding garb. Before we get to number one on our list, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to Top 5 Best. Number one, test of strength. Some weddings in South Korea involve the practice of beating a groom's feet. The groom's shoes are removed and his ankles are bound by rope as wedding attendees take turns beating his feet with a stick. It's for reasons that involve determining the man's strength, both physically and mentally. 